Like he's 20. He was a kid. Um, his life is gone. It's not, it, there's no redeeming that. And it's just, it, it puts it, you constantly questioning police officers and, and that's, and there are good police officers out there. But when these events keep happening and happening and happening and happening, and you're just, you're just forced to wonder why, like, why, why does this keep happening? Why are you smiling? I'm thinking about the, uh, the Chris Rock bit. <laughs> oh, I mean, <laughs> some jobs can't have bad you, apples. You can't have bad apples. Like some you, jobs, everybody got to be good. Like, even teachers, like we let some bad teachers fly, but you can, like every you know, American Airlines can't be like you know. If most you of to, our pilots <laughs> like to land. <laughs> if you have to train, we just got a few bad apples for a profession. You should be good at it. You should be top of the line as the wife to a black man. You know, it, it's it's very with locks. With locks, so you know he's <laughs> and a, and a already mask. he's already stereotyped, and, and it's like you know DMV records. They're not going to have on the fact that he has a, a bachelor's and a master's degree. Like they don't put that there, so that you can know that he's not he's not a threat. He's just defaulted a threat I to, just look to homeless, people, right? And that there, y'all, there are some days where I'm like, yeah, bruh, that's my wife. I just look homeless, bruh. What is going on? I have, I have leaned all the way into this pandemic dressing. Word this pandemic He'll wardrobe. come down in a polo and like my the, plaid, the most my uncle plaid PJ, PJ, PJ pants. pants and house slippers with these socks. And I'm like, what is going on? Well, it's like Bethany said, the, the socks are part of my brand. This is a bad, we my need to remarket brand. this brand. Oh yeah, man, I ain't trying to be like everybody else. I, I can't even imagine what it'd be like being a police officer in this time because people are either going to be loving you or hating you, but like there's i don't know that's just my that's my emotional feel you know i i just hate that being uh being young you know usually comes with being able to make stupid mm-hmm. mistakes and dumb decisions and live to Ooh. to talk about it and live to learn from it mm-hmm. right like part of of living is is hopefully falling forward, making mistakes and getting up and realizing your wrongs mm-hmm. and, and being a better person from it and being smarter and knowing not to make that, that decision again. Um, and even if you end up in, you know, end up in jail or prison, that's supposed to rehabilitate you so that you can, you know, you can be uh, an asset to lie to society when you come back and not yeah. a liability and not take away from it. So, it's unfortunate that, you know, we've seen time and time again that young black men aren't afforded the opportunity to make mistakes mm-hmm. because a lot of these, you know, we see these encounters, they turn, they turn fatal because of whatever you want to, whatever, you know, uh, explanation you want to roll out there, poor training, um, perceived threat, uh, non-compliance, like, a lot of these things it's almost as if they just become part of a rotation Mm -hmm. and i just think it's it's unfortunate that at 20 i mean god if i could if i could tell you all the dumb shit i did at at 20 Mm -hmm. (laughs) um i mean that's almost what 20 is for decisions that i've made that probably should have resulted in me being in a lot more trouble than than i got into uh you know i I, I've done a lot, and but I've learned from those things, and I've and I was fortunate enough to 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 not be in situations where I didn't get to learn from them because it was the last mistake or last decision I ever made. Mm-hmm. So I, I just I'm just you know, what, was it an honest mistake? It's possible, uh, but I'm just honestly, it's just like my heart just hurts that another young black man with a small child, you know, just wasn't allowed to make a mistake like mm-hmm. should should you resist no but can you blame someone for not trusting police a young black man for not trusting police probably not and yeah going through some growing pains yeah nothing but some growing pains yeah hey